What's up guys, this is A Cloud Vibes here. Today I'm gonna show you how to diversitize your drum rack. Um, specifically for your Ableton push, but it's kind of something that I was working on last night and I figured, you know what, I'd share it with you guys. So for starters, this is kind of what it looks like. So basically what we have here is multiple genres of drum racks. So for instance, we got kind of a heavier kit, more of a hip hop kit. So between all these, we have kicks that are closely related to snares. The order of it goes kick, snare, hi-hat, open hat. So we got kick, snare, hi-hat, open hat, and it goes the same across all of them. So kick, snare. And we have a variety of all sorts. So this pink column right here is its own genre. This purple column over here is its own genre. Green column, red column, so on and so forth, right? So we got more experimental, kind of like crazy trap drums. We got hip hop. We got kind of like a dubstep sort of thing. And then if you go over here, hit the octave up. Now we got cymbals in this blue column, all crash cymbals. And then one more up in this yellow column, all rides. So basically, the blue and the yellow are our symbols. And then the full columns right here, we got purple, pink, red, and green. These columns are our drum racks. So, But again, they're all arranged the same way. Kick with the closely related snare, a hi-hat that goes with it. So, you know, you get the idea. You guys can basically arrange this however you want. Um, but in particular, I, I did EDM, hip-hop, dubstep, crazy, like, trap experimental. Um, and then, again, with all the symbols above. And I think this is a, it's a great way to quickly access different genres, especially if you're jamming live. You don't have to pull in a new drum rack. You just have all your genres here and four different varieties of it. And you can mix and match. You can use, you know, this kick with this snare, um, this kick with this snare, this kick with that, you know. So you can, you can get a little crazy and creative with it. But if you're just going for quick and fast, you know that, okay, this is your go-to EDM. This is your go-to hip-hop. This is your go-to dubstep. This is your go-to trap, depending on what genre you're producing at that moment. So I thought that'd be pretty interesting to share with you guys. Um, and again, you know, you can get creative with it. But in particular, I think this drum pad um, layout is very, very efficient for production. If you guys thought this was helpful or even interesting in the slightest, please smash that like button. Uh, I'm going to be doing more videos like this, so if you're interested in that, please subscribe. Um, I really appreciate that, and happy producing, y'all. You know?